and Heather here and welcome back to my channel! Oh, I'm so excited today because I am doing a Kate Spade um, Make It Mine Birdie unboxing and I am so so happy. Um, I've been wanting this purse I think since last year and I was planning on when I got my tax refund to get the Make It Mine Birdie purse with the bunny rabbit flap. But it was just a lot of money. Even though I had my tax refund and I had enough to buy it, I felt like over $400 for a purse was a little excessive. And I'm actually glad I waited because they had an amazing sale the other day. If it's still available, I will link it down below. I don't think it is though, it was only for a couple days. Um, but I will link the items so that you can see them and maybe keep an eye. Um, I think when I got on today, they were like having a 30% off everything sale for the whole website. So I don't know what will be going on when I actually post this video. Um, but they had a special deal that if you bought or you could buy a Make It Mine base. So like the backpack, one of the purses or whatever. And then you could get two flaps for $298, which was less than the price of the Make It Mine Birdie purse that I wanted. So I was just like, oh my goodness, this is amazing. Uh, I need this purse. So luckily I was able to afford it and I have it. It has arrived. Um, this, this one here is one of them. This one came on Wednesday. Um, and I haven't opened it yet. It's supposed to be one of the flaps. And then I have my big box here. And this one came yesterday, so I've been waiting to open these for y'all. Um, so yeah, let's get into it. I'm going to open the big one first. I'm actually a little upset that these are just plain brown boxes. Like, there's no, like, Kate Spade marking or anything, but maybe that's so people won't steal your packages while they're sitting on your door. I don't know. The Kate Spade sticker. Wait, oh. oh, I ripped the sticker. <gasps> All right, here. So this is one of the flaps. I think this is the the kitty one. I got a bunny flap and a kitty flap. This was originally $98 just for the flap, just for this flap. Oh, so cute. <laughs> oh, oh, that's cool. So here is the cute little kitty flap. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. This was made in China. Has the two little flaps and oh, it has a little shiny nose and like oh, it's so cute! Oh my goodness! And then it came with a little care card, but oh, it came with its own little bag to put it in. She tucked her coral lipstick away and floated back to the party. That's so cute! I can put my little bunny or not my bunny. This one's the cat one. The cat one in the little bag to keep it safe. That's so cute! Oh my goodness! Got a little card from Kate Spain, New York. This is thank you for shopping with us. Isn't it fun to get something new? We hope you love what you got and enjoy it for years to come. We're also here to help you get what you want when you want it. These are just some of the services available to you at Kate Spain, New York. Uh, convenient shopping, personal touches, a huge community, gift now, and 24-7 support. So that's the little card that they put in there for me. Uh, here's the purse. Oh my goodness. It's a cute little baggie. So cute. Ah, oh, it pops up. That's so cool. 
Let me show you that. So you hit the two little tabbies here. Boop. And it pops up. Oh, cool. That's the thing about designer purses. They have, like, such cool, like, locking and unlocking mechanisms. Where, like, regular purses just, just like, pop open or zip or whatever. There's not, like... Oh. I actually have to... So this purse ridges was originally $328. So this was $328, the cat flap was $98, and then the bunny flap was also $98. I got all three for $298. With tax, I think it was like $315. So like, I got a really good deal. Okay, this is really hard to get. Oh, I got one. I think it's also because there's paper on it. You have to take it apart to get the paper off. Ah, there we go. Oh, I got it off. <laughs> so I can take the paper part off. Oh my goodness. But here, see, you can just take the flap off and now it looks like this. <laughs> um, and it has a long strap that comes with it. Like you have to take off their hair and then twist all their arms and their legs and all their pieces and they have the like part of it has like a plastic thing that's so like it is hard to open up a Barbie. I'm like they do not want you to get this Barbie out. So there's the nice long strap and it also has a little handle on like this. They have the special little bags to keep your purses all safe and nice. Oh, it's a cute little purse. It's very tiny, but it's got the flap in the back, which I like to put my purse in. And then, ooh, some stuff in here. Says personalized me. These bags are designed to have their very own outfit changes. Just snap on a shiny new cover of your choice and voila! It's like a whole new bag. Which is awesome. You also have that one there. I'm probably gonna keep one of those. Um, there's another care card for Kate Spade. And then how to give Birdie a new outfit. Ooh. So one, you choose a flap. Two, remove the existing flap, open bag, reach into the interior bag pocket, and unsnap the two snaps. Which is what I did with this. The, the two snaps are back here in the back portion. Um, line up the new flap with those two flaps. So let's put the, before we open up the last one, let's put on the kitty purse and see what it looks like. I'm gonna, the kitty flap. I'm just so excited. All right, so. Line up the flaps. Alright, there's something else in this box, right? Got my order form, which I won't be returning anything. I got packaging. Yep. Yeah. Hey, the box can go. It's like not wanting to line up or it's like why is it? Okay guys, this is not that easy. Okay, got one in. I feel like this flap's a little bit too big. But... 
This is a workout, y'all. I mean, it's touching the, the snap. I don't understand why it's not going in. <sighs> it's like right there and it's not snapping. Okay. Oh my goodness. Okay. That is not easy. Probably once you do it a lot of times, it will probably get easier, but like right off the bat, not so much. Yay, so here it is with the kitty flap on. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. But yeah, this is the front of it. This is the back. So it does look like this one is a little big, but it's not too bad. Plus it's on the back. But yeah, I can still put like my wallet and everything in there. But yes, there it is with the little kitty flap. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. All right, now for my bunny flap. This is the one that I really wanted. This is actually what made me want to get the purse because when they they came they've come out with several of the bunny purses, and there was this one that came out that had um it's like a fur muff one, um, and I really really wanted it, but. It was super expensive, and then it, like, sold out, and it's kind of really hard to find. Uh, so, this is a good alternative. Yeah. This will take off that. Wait. Ah! Also did the little Kate Spade and it has the little lucky whatever. I got another one of the little postcard thingies. It's in its own little baggie again. Are you ready? Are you ready? Ah! Oh my goodness, this is so cute! <laughs> love bunnies like I think bunny rabbits are just about the cutest animal on earth after a fennec fox um they're boring in my opinion to have as pets but like aesthetically they're so cute oh my goodness the little noses and the little ears and, the oh, so cute. and growing up my dad used to call me rabbit because when I ate I would wiggle my nose like a little bunny so bunnies are near and dear to my heart that's the end of that one all right, so now let's put the bunny one on. Oh, this is so exciting. I'm going to flip it open. Actually, it probably might be easier, actually, if I take these off when I go to switch them. Let's do I'll just do that. That works. There we go. There we go. I can put this into one of the little baggies to keep it safe while I'm not using it. Okay, yeah, no, it looks like they're the same size because this one also looks a little. Let's go in there and do it a little. Ah! It goes in there, but then it doesn't like lay perfectly straight. And it... ah! No! That was just glue. I thought I got makeup on it. There we go. Like right there, and I can see it going in, but it doesn't want to snap. There we go. <sighs> okay, that's a chore. Now this is apparently supposed to be the easiest one to switch. All right, here's the buddy one. <laughs> So cute! Oh, I love it! Oh yeah, and it says Kate Spain, New York right there. Oh, it's so cute! Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm gonna be wearing this like all the time. <laughs> but yes, here is my new Kate Spade purse, my Make It Mine Birdie. Oh, and it's 
it's nice. The, the flaps, though, are very, very hard to, like, change. <laughs> we'll say that. Very difficult. But this is probably going to be the main one on there because it is so cute. Oh, I love it. And then as a bonus, um, I recently got a DKNY purse from TJ Maxx. And I also got a Ted Baker watch. So I'm going to show this to you, too. I got this cute little DKNY crossbody bag which is perfect to like just throw over my shoulder and go about my business it's got the pretty little like fake lock design here that says DKNY actually there's similar colors this one I think is a little purplish tone it's got the back flap in it for my phone it's got the pretty DKNY um, inside and I currently have my stuff in here it's got got my Victoria's Secret wallet gas X got uh, this cute little cho pink chocolate mirror with a column and mirror in it it's really cute it's good for my bangs <laughs> all right my camera's dying so I have to hurry up so I have the DKNY in here and it's got the pockets and everything um, and then my Ted Baker watch let me take it off real quick. This is actually amazing because Ted Baker watches are normally like $135. I got this one for $30. It's this really pretty like white and gold with flowers on it. And it's just got a nice strap. And then it's got the Ted Baker emblem on the back. And I really like it. Well, since my camera's dying, I just want to let you all know thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button. Give me a like, and also, for when my videos pop up, please hit that little alarm bell so you know when I post. Um, I don't know what my next video is going to be yet, and um, I didn't do a book suggestion or show you what I'm reading this time because it's the same as my May and April haul. And just thanks again for watching. Bye-bye!